Hey everybody, it is time for Max's mission. A beautiful day for it. We have Coco with us hiding behind me, who's already been having a fun time with Max. He's a really sweet boy. He's got a great smile, great kisses, and he would love to be a part of your family. So we're going to let them get playing. At three years old and 45 pounds, Coco is on the move. He loves people. He loves to play. He loves to play fetch. And he listens to commands really well. His personality is like a herding dog, so there's a lot of energy there and always ready to play. It's really awesome because he also just will follow me around like my shadow and kind of also just lay at my feet and keep him warm. So he's got both of the best of both. He would love an active family, and if you work full time, that's fine with him. He's an easy boy. Potty trained, he's fixed. He will leave a ball, leave a treat. He'll wait for you at the door to let him out. He'll go right into his crate. He'll drop things that you don't want him to pick up, so that's really nice, too. If you have other dogs in your house, he's quick to learn his place, but he can be an only dog, too. He does love cats. He loves other dogs and pretty much every other animal we've found but chickens. Right now, he's working on leash training and is pretty eager to learn. Um, I just really love his personality. He um, just kind of brings a better, like a big energy to, the, to your whole life, mm -hmm. so it's really nice. All right, so we had a great time getting to know Coco today, who's staying with Stop the Suffering. Hey, buddy. If you want any more information on how you can make him a part of your family, if you need a new running buddy, seems like he'd be really good for it. And apparently, he's good with dogs and whoever, except for chickens, of course. Don't forget that. <laughs> if you want any more information on how you can adopt him, just head to my Facebook page or our website, NBC4I.com. I'll have all of that listed there. Until next week.